This video is sponsored by Moomoo. Definitely check them out. Link in the description below. Click on it, make a brokerage account, deposit $100, and get two free stocks. Five grand or more, two more free stocks. It's literally free money, guys, so why not check it out? Okay, let's get back to AMC because we're getting a lot of news and data about some of the rules being passed. And in the past few weeks of playing AMC, we all have been experiencing a massive roller coaster of emotions. AMC sometimes drops all the way down from $70 down to like 30, and then a massive rise from 30 all the way to the mid 40s, and then a massive leg down once again. So AMC is straight up one of the most volatile stocks I have ever seen. And if you zoom all the way out for AMC, you do see the stocks somewhat trying to consolidate and stabilize at around the high 30s or maybe even the low 40s. And also recently we have been getting a lot of complaints from retail traders. Retail traders are like, hey, you know, what's going on with AMC? They're like manipulation, you know, this isn't right. So we're getting a lot of rules being passed that actually benefit the retail traders. So if you check out the DTCC site, you could check this out yourself. I made several videos about this. There's a lot of wild you know, rules being passed. Some of them are already on the federal register are now being implemented. And guess what's happening? It's putting a lot of pressure on the short positions and also the hedge funds that are short on AMC. Because when you have too much short positions on the market, it's generally not a good sign and it's just not healthy. You kind of want the overall stock market and different companies to go up in value, creates more wealth, more jobs, etc. So that's what's going on. If you check out the latest filing for the NSCC 2021-0110, it says to establish securities financing transaction clearing service and also do other smaller changes. I know that sounds like a massive mouthful, so I'm going to explain this in as simple terms as possible. So if you check out some of these pages and words and documents, there seems to be a lot of different stuff. And it's really hard to read all of this. But long story short, you know how the short positions and the hedge funds have a lot of these like crazy positions. Like you have Citadel, for example, shorting AMC massively. You have a lot of naked shorting. You have a lot of dark pool activity. If you check out the dark pool activity, it was 71% of the total volume yesterday. It was insane because usually in the past 20 days, the dark pool volume is only 62%. So just the mere fact that having 71% of the total volume being on the dark pools is something very suspicious. We have been seeing some hedge funds out there having huge over leveraging positions, and that's actually putting a lot of pressure on them to halt that kind of stuff. If AMC goes all the way up to the moon, something really bad is going to happen to the US stock market. Because a lot of these massive hedge funds that are shorting AMC don't just have AMC positions short, but they also have several other stocks like Apple, Microsoft, Facebook, for example, Coca-Cola, Bank of America, stuff like that. They have a ton of other shares. And guess what's gonna happen? It's gonna cause the mother of all short squeezes. And hedge funds are essentially forced to buy back a lot of their shorts. And just given the fact that almost 90% at this point of all AMC shares are probably owned by the retail traders and the remaining being owned by ETFs, index funds, and also hedge funds, I could say a lot of retail traders are probably going to be giving out really crazy prices. And the NSCC is like, okay, this is kind of getting pretty crazy right now. We might have to add in some implications and some rules. So here's what they're going to do. When hedge funds are owing that much shares and that much money, it will be on a margin call. Auto liquidation is going to be certain, but here's the thing that will cause so much loss for the market. There will be a huge crash, like probably not like a 1929 or a 2008 crash, but it's going to be a pretty massive decrease. That's going to freak everyone out. When the mother of all short squeezes actually happen, hedge funds, instead of liquidating their position and causing a massive stock crash, which if it happens, a lot of retail traders are going to run away as well, which will make things even worse. Hedge funds could park their shares on the securities financing transactions, SFTs, and essentially allows more liquidity. And essentially SFTs will give hedge funds the money, cash, and obviously they will be making some money from the interest. That way, after they pay it off and AMC goes all the way to the moon, they could essentially recover back the shares and whatever the money they start making from regular stuff in the future, they'll slowly pay this back. So it's pretty interesting. 
And we have two scenarios here. Scenario one, there is going to be a massive AMC short squeeze. Hedge funds lose a ton of money. Stock market also crashes massively. And no one is really happy except the apes. Okay, because people's retirements, pension funds, all rely on the S&P 500, the NASDAQ, etc. The second scenario is way better, which is essentially you cause the massive short squeeze of AMC. Hedge funds are losing money. They're about to liquidate their assets, but wait, SFTs, they could park their shares there, take on a massive loan of interest, pay off AMC, get their shares back on their hands. They're gonna start making money, but they have to slowly pay off their debt. In that way, the overall stock market and other shares that are not related to AMC will be doing fine and not really having those massive crazy price fluctuations. I know a lot of you guys really dislike some of the short hedge funds. You could also argue that is it really worth it for everyday people to be losing all of their money like their pension funds, retirement plans, 401ks and stuff like that just for this. I'm not really sure. It's really up to you guys to decide. Let's just see what happens to AMC. Just the mere fact that this is even actually a rule makes me think that perhaps the mother of all short squeezes is coming very soon. For all of you AMC apes out there who are wondering how long is this going to take, remember, this is something really big that's being passed right now because no way this would be actually when the rule filings if this is not going to be possible. So there is a small probability where something like that may actually happen. And right now, there's a lot of rules being passed. There's a lot of rules being passed about how hedges and also short positions cannot over -le leverage themselves because a ton of those naked shorts could really burn you out. So they're adding a lot of locks and keys in place to make sure the ship doesn't sink and make sure everything is in good order. That's about it, guys. Thanks for watching. Comment below. Make sure to check out the private Discord server. Link in the description below. A lot of really amazing stuff. We've got several different trades, like, for example, Space Calls making 50%, 77%. And it's pretty nice. We made like a new egg trade, like 400, 500% Disney, double our money. We also have stocks that are interested in that. Several other you know areas. We also have crypto. And for the amount of stuff you get for money, this is pretty amazing. And almost 2,000 members. It's great. It's 24 7 hour support. Admin's on here. I'm on here. There's a free trial going on. It's great. Cancel before August 1st for free. Also, check out BlockFi. Link in the description below. Click on it and go BlockFi accounts. Deposit some money and get to $250 worth of Bitcoin. Once again, guys, make sure to check out Moomoo. Moo, link in the description below. It's free money, free shares. If you want to get some of these free stocks, this is definitely a few ways to do it. Just deposit 100 bucks after making an account, two free stocks, five grand or more, two more free stocks. It's a pretty good brokerage. They can trade stocks, options, pretty good customer service, and much, much more. See you guys later, and good luck on AMC. Crazy stuff is happening, and more stuff is coming in.